Good evening, Internet. And today we talk Snapchat. So for those of you not living in the 21st century, I'm going to introduce you to an app that's called Snapchat. Now what Snapchat does is basically you can send photos and pictures to your friends, family, or random ass strangers. The conception of Snapchat was a great idea. I mean, you could send these snaps and these people could see these photos for a few seconds and they're gone from existence. Of course, we know that people have taken this into a bad situation with screenshots, but the app developers at Snapchat have fully done a great job with letting people know. So nowadays you can send Snapchats to almost anybody and they also have this thing called a story where you can send your picture or video to your worldwide story that people can see if you don't even have them as a friend. Where this gets really creepy is basically people could see your photos without you giving them permission to. Now don't get me wrong, I love Snapchat as much as the next person, but at the same time I also realize the downfalls. Let me list a few. The first downfall of Snapchat, the people snapping their story and their friends. Do you have that person on Snapchat that you get a Snapchat from them and you say, oh wow, cool, a new Snapchat from this person. You go and view the Snapchat, you're about to respond, but you go check the story section of Snapchat first and you realize that the picture that they just sent you is part of their story. Now these are the type of people that I hate the most. Why would I want to give you a private picture of myself if you're just going to broadcast your stuff that you privatize to me to the whole world? I mean, I ain't got time to give you something special if you can't even give me one picture. Next we have the people that try and get attention on Snapchat. These people look a little bit like this. They're sending pictures like this with the up angle or the, the way up or the from the bottom. They're doing all these crazy angles to make themselves like a pro photographer. You might be one of those people, so pay attention. Now these people again are maybe not the best people to have on Snapchat because you know they're sending you pictures of ridiculous looking artwork or they're, son they're showing you their whole world through their Snapchat story or through the snaps that they give to you. Now I mean, I think we're all capable of doing that. We also do that on an app called Instagram, but uh, we don't need to see your artistic nature. Just buy a camera, take some photos and put them online. And lastly, we have the people on Snapchat that that just like to never respond. You know, you send them a Snapchat and they might be your friend. They might be your friend for ages or for years, right? They're, they're, they're there to give you the Snapchat feedback and, and, and read it. But then you wait a couple hours and they, they still didn't send anything back. And I mean, I'm fine with that kind of concept once in a while, right? You send something that might not get a response, that's fine. But what happens when it's all the time with these people? and they never send you a snap, right? You're sitting there like, damn, I just wish, I wish they would send me something back. I feel, I'd feel my self-worth. I'd feel so good inside. You know, I thought I used to be cool. I thought, I thought we used to be friends, but you forgot to send me a snap. But in all seriousness, Snapchat is an awesome app. And I mean, like I said, if you haven't heard of it, at least try it out. Give yourself a try. Don't be one of those people, or you can be one of those people and just be, a, be an idiot to your friends. I mean, your friends, I think, will really appreciate that. And uh, that's all for today's video. So if you liked it, go ahead and click that thumbs up because that is apparently the universal symbol for um, appreciating things. Also, if you want to be part of the next video and want to have a say, add your comment down below what you'd like me to do. If not, then you're not going to get a say. And that'll be it for today and we're in our weird Snapchat talk. I'm JC and I'll see you in the next one.